Greetings, love beings. This is Mother God, and joining us is Orion. He just joined us about, what, three weeks ago? Yes. Showed up here synchronistically, right out of the blue. Another love surprise. <laughs> My seventh life change event in uh, six, seven months. Well, one a month. We're on a roll. <laughs> <laughs> Literally. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So we had a few uh, things we wanted to share with you about uh, how, well, we teamed up. So there's been some changes. Uh, we're sharing our gifts. What, what's happening is that we combined our gifts and we're sharing those with humanity, with all of you, because we love you so very much. And just to give you some background, uh, we know it's been a moment, a couple of weeks since, well, we put a short video out, but uh, during this change, we had to energetically prepare ourselves for it, and um, everything changed very fast. Yes, right? yes, and we had to keep up with the energies. Right, right. But now we're ready to put this video out and to share with you uh, what we are now doing, because we are, are now um, what they call spiritual doctors. And this makes sense for me personally because um, the 13th zodiac I was born in, uh, Ophiuchus, Sagittarius, but also Ophiuchus. And Ophiuchus is the spiritual doctor. And for many, many years, for set, well, seven years now of doing awakening sessions, um, I've always gone into the fields to see where blocks were and things like that. So I've always had that uh, gift. But now it's, it's expanded. It's now becoming, it's, you know, it's spiritual doctor. It's exciting. It's uh, what's unfolding for us. And every day is something new and we understand something more. And we do this, what we're doing uh, together with Cryon and a whole light team. So, and then were you here when I had that vision or you, you weren't here yet about the red dragon snake? Yes, I was here. Okay. So I was sitting outside it must have been two weeks ago, before this unfolded for us. And I had this vision of this like red snake or red dragon come right out of my heart, up through my throat, up through my pineal gland and out. And this huge bright light just appeared uh, in my vision. And quickly after this is when the spiritual doctor uh, thing began opening up for us. So Orion and I, Orion arrived here by surprise. We had about what a hundred something synchronistic events. Occurring in, yeah. Uh, within a short time. Yeah. Uh -huh. You want to share anything about that? When we met, we didn't know who we were exactly. Yeah. But we had the connection immediately. Right. And began getting to work. <laughs> yes, so to speak. Especially with the simulation of the ego. Mm, right. And right. subsequently, the um, elimination of the superego as well. Right. Which is part of all that's associated with the implants. Right. Right. And so let's talk, I guess we'll talk about the implants, about what's what's happening with that. You know, I've we've always I've always known about the implants, and um, but it wasn't something that was in my direct awareness to be accomplishing until have a two-hour meeting with Cryon about it, and he shares with me the importance of the, this is what's happening next. You're moving into this level of work, and this is what we need to accomplish because it's the implants that are preventing the awakening process. Uh, besides that, causing more pain and suffering that's unneeded uh, and it was a part of the, the powers who were's plan to keep humanity dumbed down, to keep the awakening process from happening. But, you know, uh, tricks on them because we figured it out. And so we're capable, we go by permission, with, with your permission. We go in with Cryon and a light team, uh, Orion and I do. And we are able to see where all the implants are uh, in the body. And uh, then Cryon helps us uh, disable those and disengage. And uh, what we're finding right now, uh, very fascinating, is a lot of mutations are happening. 
You want to explain the mutations? Absolutely. The mutations are occurring mainly within one's core, whether that be the stomach or the heart, where they, where they feel the most or they're affected the most by the implants themselves. The implants um, cohe being cohesive to the, the tissue of the stomach or the heart and growing from there, expanding, having these tentacle-like structures expanding from the microchip themselves. That they placed. Yeah, what they did is they placed microchips. And I just want to quickly, they're probably going, how did I get those in me? <laughs> well, <laughs> well, um, how they're doing it is through the vaccinations is one way. The second way is through surgeries, any surgeries that you've had. Uh, the third way is in the military. And what else? Can you see? Surgeries, and, uh, military, vaccinations. And through paranormal or extraterrestrial oh, okay. experiences. Mm -hmm. okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And so, anyway, we're able to remove these and uh, to help you, assist you in your awakening process. That doesn't... It doesn't mean we're doing any work, the work for you, but we're removing what has been placed upon you by the powers who were so that you can get on with your real awakening process and get in joy. Uh, we're finding that these chips are causing, there is a disease. Uh, it's creating um, a lot of people in the stomach area. A lot of people are going over, getting overweight uh, because of these chips, uh, which is another part of, you know, keeping people dumbed down and, and in pain, yes, basically, and suffering. Yes, diet. Right, right. <clears throat> um, so that's what we are doing now, and we are, we are doing these every day, beginning at 5 o'clock p.m. Mountain Time until 10 p.m. at night, and we uh, do them individually. Um, also, along with this... Uh, New, a new set of Ascension Angels uh, are being revealed to everybody through us uh, who get the implant removals. And once you get the implant removals, the only way that you can get another implant is if you have the surgery again or you go in the military or you um, get a, a flu shot or all, any vaccination, any, any of their injections. Uh, but, you know, then we just remove them again, you know, come back to us and <laughs> remove them. Yes. So, you know. Uh, basic, idea of, uh, yeah, go ahead, love. The idea of the ascension angels is to assist those who have had the implant removal so they won't have the implants reinserted into the body. Mm -hmm. And they're able to assist with debriefing or orientation, if you will. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I, I talked about of oh, Ucas already, didn't I? Yes. Yeah, okay. Um, anything else? Okay, so 5 o'clock p.m. every every day the link you can find below uh, it's the tiny chat room 5d room that we're doing these uh, the other night was really exciting we had what 30 people yeah 30 people, 30 people and we're getting amazing amazing responses everybody people can feel the surgeries they know that we're doing those um, and you know a lot of people out there we heard are doing implant removals uh, according to what cryon is sharing with us uh, is that the the level of implant removal that we're doing is on a very high level uh, because we're doing it inside the unified field energy, which is pure consciousness, and uh, we're utilizing cryon services. Mm -hmm. And, you know, when this whole thing began, I forgot about this part. Mm -hmm. When this whole thing began, I, I had forgotten that I'd spent almost a year with cryon uh, in 2007 as he was removing my implants. And so this totally makes perfect sense now, uh, what has unfolded for us. And also, <clears throat> this is the stone that we use to assist us. This is, I say this, lapis lazuli. Yes. Yeah. Uh, wow. Looks like the planet. Looks like cryon symbol, too. I found that fascinating. Mm -hmm. More um, synchronicities. Yeah, more synchronicities. They're just, wow. wow Especially wow, wow. with music. <laughs> yeah. And so... Um, Anyway, what was the... Now I totally forgot. The, <laughs> <'Cause> you're, <laughs> you're working oh, the, with these this, energies. Yeah, this but, stone. Uh, uh, I say it's a she, androgynous, but mm -hmm. she 
Um, wow, what a powerful, she won't leave me alone. I have to carry her. Um, the lapis lazuli in Egypt, it was worth more than gold. And um, I can definitely understand why. This is powerful. We're using this also for the new earth energies hmm. to assist us in the new paradigm. Um, she's amplifying our energy a thousandfold and more. Uh, mm -hmm. I think it intensifies every moment. And we're working through a lot of things within our own energetic fields very rapidly. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So, so with the implant removals. Yeah. I mean, magic and miracles are happening, everybody. Truly. We're watching it right before our eyes. Mm. This totally came out of the, you know, love surprise. And, and that's how this energy is right now. It's mm -hmm. full of just surprises. Like, wow. It'll just come right yes. to you right out of the blue. Mm -hmm. 180 degree turns, um, meeting people and having different, having connections. I mean, it's all, I can see the energy moving very fast. Mm -hmm. And it is. Yes. So yesterday we entered a huge energetic gateway and portal. And we saw, I saw this in a vision last night and mm -hmm. felt it. And uh, some of the team members were able to feel it on the land here where we have 13 stargates, everybody. And again, stargates are energetic points that were connected to the ships up there. Golden energy, invisible to most people. Okay. All right, so you can find the link below to join us for those implant removals. Please share with your, your friends and family. Uh, this is really important because the more the remo that we have the removals, the implant removals, the more the awakening process can proceed very quickly because it's, according to what Cryon shared with us, it's these implants that were uh, stalling uh, the process for us. So we're going to go zoom in right ahead, I feel. Yes. Well, <laughs> thank okay. you. Thank you for all of you for being who you are and being able to come with us and trusting us for that support. Mm hmm and being able to trust in our, our guides and our angels as well. Yeah, for sure. And we will continue to do this work. Yeah. Yeah. And it, so we could get the whole planet and then everybody's awake and happy mm -hmm. and enjoy and abundant and true equality mm -hmm. and happiness every moment, peace, mm -hmm. lots of laughter. And always love. <laughs> for sure. <laughs> All right, everyone. Was there anything else? I think you just about said it, dear. Okay. <laughs> All right. All right, love. So anticipate more of these types of videos and uh, this pro this these gifts that have opened up for us are expanding every moment, becoming grander, uh, which is another exciting factor in this for us um, because our whole being is here to be of service to all of humanity in whole truth and um, wholeness of being and as living examples of the new reality well the true reality and the new paradigm that we're in hmm? and yeah. will be in yeah yeah this is it yeah so <laughs> stay tuned everybody we love you so very much mwah, mwah, mwah. And see you tonight or tomorrow night or come join us. It's so much fun. Magic and miracles, everybody. Truly so. Mwah.